Written by PTI Updated, February 1, 2018, 9.05 p.m. Irish Summer Time Exchange platforms dealing in controversial cryptocurrencies like Bitcoins on Thursday asserted that it's business as usual, hours after Finance Minister Aaron Jaitley declared such instruments as illegal. There is no change in the government stance with respect to trading cryptocurrencies. Cryptocurrency holders need not panic and the business is as usual, chief executive and co-founder of Unoco and Sathvik Vishwanath said. Another player Zebpay's Nishint Sanghavi claimed that Jaitley's comments are being misreported to say that bitcoins are illegal and affirmed his exchange's full support to the government to eliminate their use in illegitimate activities. This announcement does not affect our customers as we hold the highest standards for know your customer and anti-money laundering policies, he said. Belfrix Global's chairman Praveen Kumar Vijayakumar said the government is taking time to understand the crypto world and the country. Global share on cryptocurrency market is steadily increasing. Government intervention can only help regulate this entire industry, he said. Amid a huge spike in the value of the unregulated cryptocurrencies, which are, mined, using secret algorithms based on the blockchain technologies, Jaitley today said such instruments are illegal and vowed that government will work to eliminate their use for illegal activities and also being used in the payment system. Government does not consider cryptocurrencies legal tender coins and will take all measures to eliminate use of these crypto assets in financing illegitimate activities or as part of the payment system, Jaitley said in the budget speech. The head of Blockchain and Cryptocurrency Committee of India Ajit Karana interpreted the minister's remarks as a clear indication of how important and widespread this technological innovation has become in the country. We welcome the statement, and reaffirms our unstinting assistance to the government, and all regulators, in helping evolve a robust ecosystem for cryptocurrencies, Karana added. It can be noted that the Reserve Bank has been warning the public regularly against the risks that such instruments pose and has made its discomfort clear multiple times. Necessary next step is for government to legislate and thereafter regulate cryptocurrencies in the country. Clarifications are needed in respect of taxability, KYC norms, transferability, ownership, acquisition of cryptocurrencies here, Malev Varani of the law firm MDP and Partners said. The sector also welcomed the positive approach with which government is looking at the blockchain technologies on which such cryptocurrencies are based.